All right, let's talk about graphing from standard form. Standard form is y equals ax squared plus bx plus c, where you've got numbers in front of your x squared, your x, and your have a constant at the end. You, b or c could be zero, and then that just means that you don't have either the linear term or the constant term. So when you're doing this, you're always going to start off with your axis of symmetry, which is x equals negative b over 2a. Well, in this case, our a is 2, b is negative 3, c is, did I say negative 3? Negative 4, c is 3. So, negative b is going to be negative negative 4, which is positive 4 times 2 times your a. Well, and that just comes up to be 1. So my axis of symmetry is x equals 1. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to sketch that right now. So that means that that is the center of my parabola. Now I want to go ahead and find the vertex. Well, I already know the x-coordinate of the vertex because it has to lie on the line of symmetry. I need to know y. So I'm going to put y equals, and then I just take that 1, and I plug it in. So 2 times 1 squared minus 4 times 1 plus 3. It's going to give me 2 minus 4 plus 3 which is going to be 1. So my vertex is 1, 1. Put a dot at 1, 1. Well, my easiest thing here now is to find my y-intercept. My y-intercept is c. Well, in this case, c is 3. So my y-intercept is 0, 3. I'm going to go ahead and put a dot at 0, 3. And then I'm going to put one directly on the other side because that's the mirror image. And then my parabola is now graphed. If you notice, this one doesn't have any x-intercepts. That happens on occasion. Hope you enjoyed.